everyone, welcome back to my channel and today we're gonna to talk about the different reasons why you should get an engineering degree. So, let's get started. There are many reasons why a student may major in engineering and one of the reasons that I personally majored in computer engineering was because of the salary and also the familiarity with it. My dad was an electrical engineer and I was very familiar with math. It was always kind of around. So those were the two main reasons why I decided to major in computer engineering. But there are many other reasons. Now I'm gonna just talk about the other ones that just aren't as common, the ones that uh, people don't really think about and that I think you should definitely consider if you are, you know, deciding whether or not you should major in engineering. Um, so with that, I'm gonna get to it. The very first reason why you should major in engineering is because there's a wide variety of topics that you could do. Um, for example, there's electrical engineering, there's chemical engineering, there's uh, computer engineering, there's aerospace engineering. Um, there's a wide variety of different types of engineers. It's not the typical uh, thing that most people think of, which is, oh, an engineer, they just go and build something and then it works. Uh, it's not like that. There are engineers who uh, work with the you know, liquids and you know, working on the chemistry part. And then there are others who work on the computer. They go and program. There's others who work on the hardware of the computer. So they work on circuits or microprocessors. And then you have aerospace engineers, which you know, develop and design aircrafts, which could be really cool to some people. Um, but that's the whole point is that engineering is not just one thing. There's a wide variety of things that you could do as an engineer um, and you there might be something that just piques your interest and you could go and do that now the next reason that just isn't as common is you'll come out of the engineering degree with more knowledge and more experience than what you would expect now of course with engineering you think okay math and science those are the going to be the two main things I'm going to learn. And yes, you'll know a lot about math and science and you know, everything about that particular field, but you'll also come out with much more knowledge than just that engineering degree. You'll be doing presentations, you'll be working in groups, you'll be able to learn how to use your communication skills in order to explain something that you're working on. Um, you'll also be learning how to develop PowerPoints and you know the list can go on. You'll be technically getting that experience in like a communications degree. That's the great part about majoring in engineering is because you get more than just that that engineering degree. So the next reason why you should get an engineering degree is the internships. But the internships are very rewarding in terms of money and also experience. I know this personally because when I was an intern, I learned so much about the workplace. It's just mind boggling to know that, uh, yes, you're learning so much information from college, but yet you still don't know anything when it comes to the workforce and the workplace and being able to navigate yourself around there. Um, again, I can't put it into words, but when you have an internship, uh, engineering internship, when you do graduate and you do um, apply to a job, you'll know what to expect and it won't be as terrifying. The only thing that might be a little scary is learning the job description and being able to measure up to the standards, the, the expectation and how to perform and everything. But it's also very rewarding to be an intern because you can work with other engineers. You can work with them on their projects and learn and see and and just watch, you know, shadow them, see how they work, see what they do. And you can also see if you actually like what you're majoring in. With college, you just you just don't get that. You don't get that firsthand experience. And the other thing about being an engineering intern is that you do get paid. I had heard of interns who don't get paid anything for what they do, and they're out there getting coffee, running errands, um, probably helping with you know like admin work. But as an engineer, not only are you learning and you're helping, but you're also getting paid, and you're getting paid a pretty good amount. Um, when I was an intern, I got paid I think $22 an hour when I first started and this was when I was a, uh, just starting as a junior. So I was still fairly new and very unexperienced but it was $22 and that was like in 2017 and it was it was a lot. So I was very happy about that. And then it, you know, it just went up from there. Um, as I got further along in my degree, I got paid more and more as an intern. That's just something that you should definitely think about when you are deciding whether or not you should major in engineering. You get a very good opportunity when it comes to the internship. The other reason why you should major in engineering and something you should consider is the demand for it because there's not very many. It's a very difficult degree to get to begin with. It's one of the hardest ones. Um, a aside from, from medicine and science, uh, but it's, it's something that not very many people do and not very many people get because of the difficulty. There's low supplies, so there's gonna be high demand, and that's great. You know, you can go and, and apply to practice 
practically any job almost. And even if you're not the best engineer or you're not, you know, great at programming or whatever it is, you're still more likely to get a job than if you were, let's say, an expert in marketing or an expert in, in finance because there are many more people there. There's so much more competition and it's just something that you should definitely consider because, you know, I was one of those people. I wasn't great at engineering. I was pretty average, if not below average. And a lot of the times I'm like, what's going on? Um, but you know, it's, they still hired me. And you know, it could have not only been that I'm an engineer, but also because I'm a female, I could see that too. And I'm part Mexican. So that was also probably it as well. Um, but it's just something that I was like, okay, well, that's still pretty cool. I'm, I'm not, I'm not complaining about it. It's still nice to get hired. Um, but you know, it's just something you should consider, especially if you're a minority female. It's going to be difficult, but it's a safe bet. Uh, you're, you're probably going to get hired in your first year out of college. Nowadays, it is all about diversity. And so that's what companies are looking for. But it's just another reason why you should major in engineering because it is in very high demand. So the last reason why you should major in engineering and one that's just not as common is that you are going to most likely help in a very significant way. And the work you do is going to impact a lot of people. It doesn't matter what engineering field it's in. And this is mainly because the whole goal of an engineer is to find a problem and find a solution to that problem or fix the existing problem. And when you fix problems, you end up impacting others. It doesn't have to be a large scale of people. It could just be one or two people, but it could go as large as the entire world. Um, you help invent a new software, a new tool, um, a new infrastructure that other people use. I, I can't come up with any really good examples. The only things I could come up with are like the phones, the apps on those phones, uh, you know, Microsoft Teams, Zoom, being able to video conference, um, this right now, being able to record this video and then upload it on YouTube, developing, improving, enhancing, whatever it may be. That's all engineering right there. And I think that's something everyone wants to do is to impact the world in a positive way. It's just something that, you know, a lot of students don't think about because when you're a student, you just think about that current work or you think, oh, this is all that engineers do. That's so boring. Or they just do a bunch of math and that's it. Well, there's more to it than that. You don't really see it until you are an engineer and you are working and you've been working for a couple years because it, it's a long and slow process. But when you do a complete a project or you help develop something, um, you'll see the fruits of your labor, so to speak. And you'll be able to see, oh yeah, I was a part of that. I helped, you know, in that area because I helped in that project or I helped develop that new thing. But yeah, that's the last reason why I think you should definitely major in engineering and something you should consider. I hope you guys liked this video. And if you did, please let me know in the comment section down below. And if you have any other video suggestions or would like to see more of this kind of content, um, please also leave it in the comments. And yeah, I hope you guys like this video and thank you for watching. Bye.